Hi everyone, welcome to Physics Coach. Myself Ankit. So in this question is very easy question, similar as the previous question. Now in this question, I am asking the find the acceleration of log that seen by the chintu. Now our chintu is uh, in the lift. This is a lift in which our chintu is uh, standing. This is a lift, and this is the chintu who is the observer. Is it clear? So I want uh, what is the acceleration of these two blocks as seen by the chintu. Now these uh, the our condition of visible constant relation theory is not valid so i will take i don't know what is the acceleration what is the direction i am just taking a1 a2 like this is it clear because this pulley is going up i am assuming that both the blocks are moving up it may one may be go down one may be go up so if a1 is coming out to be negative it means uh, whatever assumption i have taken it is different clear now i am just assuming like uh, both the blocks are moving with a1 a2 acceleration in upward direction now i will apply the i will draw the uh, i will decide the observer our observer is chim2 so as per chim2 i will draw first this is my system so now i will draw the free body diagram of this make it make this free like this now i will draw all the forces acting on the system one is its weight one is direction of tension force clear so tension force here t here also t because both the blocks same strings are connecting both the blocks so tension will be same now tell me pseudo force there will be pseudo force because chim2 is in the non inertial frame this frame is accelerating with 5 meter per second is square so what is the pseudo force? Pseudo force one one the two kg block will be mass of system multiply acceleration of chin two uh, as seen from the ground. So if this uh, lift is going up with five meter per second is square, clear. So chin two will also move with five meter per second is square. So pseudo force on one kg block will be ten newton. Similarly on three kg block, three into five. So this is tension. Now we will apply the Newton's law in x and y direction. Now tell me, is the system is moving in x direction? No. This system is moving in upward direction means y direction. Now we will apply the Newton's law in y direction on one on two kg block and three kg block. Now on two kg block, I will apply. See here, net force in y direction is equal to mass of system multiply its acceleration in y direction. Now see net force on 2 kg block. This is my 2 kg block. Is it clear? Now on this 2 kg block, tension up, tension up, then minus 20, minus 10. This is mass of chin 2 is 2, not chin 2, 2 kg block multiply A1. Similarly, equation 1, one more equation will be T minus 30 minus 15 is equal to 3 into a2 equation 2 now i need one more equation in order, in order to solve i know what is that acceleration of pulley is equal to a1 plus a2 by 2 now this a1 a2 is with respect to the chin2 now the pulley acceleration must be with respect to the chin2 because i will take all the measurements with respect to chin2 only so acceleration of pulley we will calculate with respect to chin 2 will be AP minus AC. So acceleration of pulley if nothing is given always take with respect to ground. So pulley is moving with respect to ground with what acceleration 10 minus chin 2 is moving with 5. So it is coming out to be acceleration of pulley as seen by the chin 2 will be 5 meter per second square. Is it clear? Now we can apply one more equation AB, A1 plus A2 is equal to 2 AP. So one more equation I am getting a1 plus a2 is equal to twice of acceleration of pulley as seen by the chin 2 that is 5. So a1 plus a2 is equal to 10. Equation third. Now three equation three variable we can easily solve. So finally you are getting how much? What is the answer? Tell me. Just write down the answer and solve at your home. This is your homework. A1 comes out to be how much? 9 meter per second square and a2 is 1 meter per second square now i my next question is 
if a1 is with respect to the chain 2 as seen by the chain 2 now what is the acceleration of similar a1 block or 2 kg block a1 is the acceleration of 2 kg block a2 is the acceleration of 3 kg block so i am asking what is the acceleration of 3 kg block as seen from the ground so a1 a1 is with respect to chain 2 is how much 9 so a1 acceleration of 1 kg block with respect to ground minus acceleration of chin 2 with respect to ground is equal to 9. So chin 2 acceleration of 1 kg block with respect to ground minus acceleration of chin 2 with respect to ground is 5 is equal to 9. So 14 meter per second is the acceleration of 2 kg block as seen from the ground. So here not it is not 1 this is 2 kg block 2 kg and 3 kg block. So this 2 kg block if a person is looking this 2 kg block from the ground, so according to him, this 2 kg block is moving with what acceleration? Tell me, this 2 kg block is moving with 14 because if this block is moving 9 meter per second square with respect to chin 2, now according to the person who is standing on the ground, this acceler acceleration of this 2 kg block will be 14 meter per second is square clear now similarly for 3 kg block it will be how much for 3 kg block tell me what is the answer i am writing here similar 3 kg block as seen by chin 2 how much just now you just calculate one so i am asking what is the acceleration of 3 kg block with respect to ground minus acceleration of chin 2 with respect to ground is equal to 1. So this is given 5. So it will be answer comes out to be 6. So simply conversion of frame remember acceleration of pulley with respect to chin 2 will be AP. Write AP AC. Clear? Now take minus. If nothing is given always take ground. So this is the conversion of frame. Conversion of one frame to another frame means now I know the value of acceleration of pulley with respect to the frame chin 2. Now I want the acceleration of the pulley with frame ground. Is it clear? So here two frames are here. One is chin, uh, one is chin 2 and uh, one is ground. When I am saying chin 2 is a frame means frame means frame means a person frame means a point a position where our observer is present. So it is the name of a name of name of a what? Name of a place where our observer is present. So our observer is in the lift. So our frame is here lift. One frame is ground. Is it clear? So thank you so much. Thanks a lot for watching this. And keep asking your doubt. Keep growing. Thank you so much. Thanks.